Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to talk about what to wear for motorcycle rides. Okay? So the first most important thing is to have like a dry fit shirt, comfortable. It doesn't have to be any specific brand. This is a Patagonia brand that I'm wearing. But it has to be light and easily, you know, wicker away the sweat. So that you make sure that when you're riding, if you start to sweat, this will dry easily. These are also very easy to wash. So you can wash these very quick if you're on the road. So the first thing I wear as a layer is a shirt. This is not just any shirt. This is a, bi a bike shirt. Okay, it's got some Kevlar inside. It's got layers. It's also got a zipper so that, you know, when you're riding, the buttons don't flap open. So this is by a brand called Speed and Strength. And they're very good for their shirts. So my first layer is always a riding shirt and it's a little bright color so this has the buttons and I like the buttons so they're easy so this shirt you can actually go on a date you know take your girlfriend wear this shirt and enjoy so it's got strength in this shirt here so if you fall you're not gonna have any you know abrasion or your skin is not gonna peel off so it's not got armor but it's well made and built strong couple of pockets so this was speed and strength brand but you can get any shirt brand okay let's look at what goes over the shirt so for winter I prefer leathers so I've got a lot of leather jackets unfortunately they are all Harley Davidson so now with BMW coming I need to think how to get into BMW slowly they are so expensive so this is a Harley Davidson uh, leather jacket a biker jacket and this is just a regular lucky brand but a leather jacket so I can use this also any leather is good for protection so it's great because in winter here it also provides the warmth on days which are little warmer I can wear a leather sleeveless jacket I'll show you how this works so got my Harley badges there always a Harley boy even though I ride a BMW now so this combo is great because I wear it over the shirt and it looks kind of smart and keeps the wind out and this also has buttons if you see here and a zip so that's great so the shirt and uh, combo with this leather jacket you can wear for a cruiser or sports bike and it protects your vital organs uh, the leather obviously is nice strong leather so this sleeveless leather jacket jacket was a brand called street and steel street and seal so pretty good brand the leather is good quality as you all know the cost of leather in the US is very high so coming to my all-time favorite Harley leather jacket that looks so cool guys so I usually wear this over the shirt or if it's too hot that day I just wear the jacket with a t-shirt so this is how it goes the Harley leather jacket you know it's got the riding options here so when your hands are on the handlebar it can stretch a little great so after wearing the jacket and the shirt I like to wear like a neck warmer bakalava kind of thing so it goes around your face you can wear the helmet over it if it's very cold otherwise just as a neck warmer like this but I like to tuck it in the shirt before riding so that it's all there and this is adjustable so you know you do what you want with it with a very cold wearing a half helmet you can do that so I did a review of my helmets check out that video I'm not going to show you much of the helmets today okay so for the bottoms it's mostly jeans I mostly wear jeans So I like jeans but I, I also have a jeans which got the 
you know knee guards but that's a little bulky to wear so sometimes you can wear that but if it's a very long ride but usually i think just regular thick denim jeans are just perfect hope everyone's safe from the corona virus guys please stay safe okay all this biking and fun videos on youtube is of no use if someone is sick okay stay, uh, stay safe and stay healthy okay so pretty much you know the jacket shirt and inner layer is what i wear on my uppers with the neck warmer and I'm not going to wear the helmet, but you guys know the helmet's going to go over that. So that's common sense. Now I just want to show you a couple of shoes that I wear. And then we're kind of done with this video. It may be a short one, but let's see. Okay, guys. The first shoe I want to show you is obviously, no guesses, Harley Davidson. So these are the waterproof boots by Harley Davidson, which are awesome for riding. Okay, look at that sole, the grip while riding. So these are just so cool and uh, they're not even very expensive. I think I got these on sale for like a hundred bucks. They're much more otherwise. So these are the, you know, let's look here. The Men Homes Medium Moven Moyen, Medium Lambert. So the Lambert is the name of these shoes by Harley Davidson. I'm going to still use these even on the BMW. The next riding shoe I use is Speed and Strength. Okay. So they're good for shoes as well. Let me show you these. So these are more like a casual kind of sneaker. They've got a white sole which is quite good for the fashion minded people. So this you can walk in after a bike ride into a party or anything. I think these are really padded well on the sides here. Just look at the thickness of that padding. So these are the boots I usually wear. Speed and strength. Yeah. When I'm riding around town, then I just use my simple Doc Martin slip-on, not slip-on, but these sh regular shoes with some good socks. So that's when I'm doing like local riding, etc. Okay. So guys, you know, I've changed from Harley Davidson to BMW. So I did not want to change my helmet and waste more money. So what I've got is some BMW stickers, which I've stuck over my Harley Davidson, the stickers I had for Harley Davidson, I put a BMW sticker on there. The helmet's looking quite cool. It's got some Harley Davidson left on it for the memories. But otherwise, this is my GoPro mount for the GoPro 7. I've got the dark shade and of course, this is Arai helmet. You can look at more details on my helmet videos. So that's pretty much what I use for my day-to-day -day riding. This shirt is really nice. I can wear it, you know, anywhere. It doesn't have to be on the bike. So guys, hope you like this video. Invest in some good safety gear. If you're spending lakhs of rupees or thousands of dollars on a bike, you need to make sure that you at least have some basic good quality jackets, shirts, outer layers, inner layers, you know, keep the shirts buttoned up when you're riding. Make sure you have some good gloves. Thanks guys. Okay, hope everyone liked the jackets and the video. It was a very small video, but hope you liked it. All right, see you on the weekend then. Take care, bye.